Hey guys, and welcome back to Clock Tower. When we last left off, we managed to get ourselves to the Barrows Castle in England. And unfortunately, uh, out of the 10 of us that arrived here, Harris turned out to be the copycat scissor man, but he is not the scissor man, and he has apparently been horribly murdered after admitting that he was a pedo and trying to do bad things to Jennifer. Which actually is pretty fucking crazy for a game of this this age, actually. Uh, anyway, glossing over that. Uh, also, we have found that Gotts has been horribly murdered. Assistant Inspector Gotts. So, let's keep exploring, shall we? Now, uh, one thing to note. I'm probably going to make these next two videos... Oh, he's coming. He's coming. Oh, Lord, he's coming. Yeah, these next few videos are going to be like 20 minutes long. Just because I've run out of time to record this week. It's getting harder and harder to produce seven 30-minute videos a week. Right, he's coming from that way. All right. Well, let's see if we can find someone. Uh, yeah, that's not going to work out very well for us at all, is it? All right. Oh, hey, friend. Come on, you big ugly bastard. Let's do this. Let's go through here. So we've got a big door behind us, which apparently is padlocked. So that's no good. Oh. Yeah, I forgot we had a dark corridor. I remember drawing a map for this place. Oh. That's not fantastic. Oh. No, that works. That, that, that does, does not work. Dead end. That did not work at all, did it? Oh, we actually start right here, which is actually quite nice. It's very brave of Jennifer, to be honest. What's the... How do we... Get out of that then. Is there something we have to grab here? Possibly. I thought this was just a panic bit. There's nothing actually here to grab, to be honest. Nope, we just have to mash the buttons like your life depends on it. Well, I guess he's going to have a bit of a headache tomorrow. That's fine with me. That was actually pretty cool. So, so far, well, I suppose we've started down here. We'll keep exploring. So far, we have dropped a big spiky stone thing on him, I guess, which was very entertaining. Now we've just dropped him down, God knows how far. And one thing I. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't go out. Don't go out the, uh, the door. I will say, using this emulator, this game looks way better than it did the first time I played it. And monumentally better than the uh, PlayStation original version, which, you know, you expect. What's this? There's something shiny under the tree. Looks like a drain valve. Uh, you gonna use it then? No? Okay. So it looks like Helen's over here. That's not Helen. Oh, that's Professor Button. It's covered with moss, but the water is very clean. Yeah. Hey, Prof. How are you doing? Look like you're in a bit of a bad way. Jennifer. Professor Barton? Professor Barton? Are you all right? I'm not injured. This is an extremely important experience for me. Because here I am at the site of the murders. A very, very intriguing situation. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, yeah, so you're in your idea of heaven. 
But you're taking a little nap under a tree. Okay. Professor Barton, are you all right? I'm not injured. This is an extremely important experience. Okay, so we're just gonna. Because here I am at the site of the murders. A very, very intriguing situation. Okay, we're just gonna leave him sit there. Because why not, I guess. Uh, no one has taken care of these for a long time. The trees and plants are all very overgrown. Yeah, I don't really quite know what this area is. It's kind of like a courtyard. But it doesn't feel like it's outside. This is a very enclosed area. It's a little bit strange. But whatever. Whatever. Let's keep moving. We'll leave Professor Barton to just nap. Because apparently that's what he's doing. Let's check this room. So does this connect to the other side? Uh, it kind of does. Yeah. Right, okay. So let's try going through this one. If you're wondering if I know where I'm going, uh, I don't. <laughs> this is all guesswork. We're just, ooh, we're just exploring this area together. Expensive looking plates. They are smashed into pieces. It'll be dangerous to step on them. Uh, why? Why would it be dangerous to step on them? A huge stew pot. Something strange is inside. Well, why don't we have a look? Uh, no, not gonna have a look. We just, we just gonna leave it at that. All right. There's some strange stuff inside, apparently, but we don't know what it is. Is it moldy food? Maybe. So, what do we have here? Heavy stout frying pan. All right. It's very important to our investigation, you know. So, this is the kitchen. And there doesn't appear to be anything too useful here. Although, I'm guessing there's a lot of items to whoop a scissor man's ass with if we need to. Nothing inside. I think we can hide in that box. Oh. Speaking of which, I was going to say, I think we can hide in here. Hey, buddy. Hey. Ah. Oh, savage. Absolutely savage. How did he know? But how did he know? Little son of a bitch. All right. Well, fuck that guy. Some dried up goods. Some canned foods, swollen and distorted. Well, that ain't no good. Cans of food. I'd get sick if I ate these. Well, it depends. What's here? The floorboards are loose. Yeah, but can we not do anything with the floorboards? I guess we need some kind of tool. Alright then. So, hiding in the box. Not a good idea, apparently. Okay. So, we've got a pot. We could probably throw that at Scissor Man. I guess. Garbage can. There is something stuck to the bottom. What? You could just say there's like nothing useful here. Instead of saying, yeah, there's something there. Kitchen counter. Right. So there's nothing that useful in the kitchen whatsoever. I'm pretty sure in the pantry, there can sometimes be somebody. Just not this particular time. Pretty sure it's one of the women. Um, okay. Well, let's keep going this way then. 
Oh! <laughs> Oof. Not great. That could have gone better. And we've taken uh, a point of damage there, which... Yeah, not great, actually. But whatever. Fine. Uh, now, let's go back through here. Start exploring this room again. Now, we could go through there. There was let's see if there's oh, let's check this. An oil painting. Bits of paint have flicked off. Yeah, must be pretty old then. So we haven't been in that door yet. I wonder when it was last used. It's covered with dust. I don't think we've been in there yet, have we? Haven't been in there yet. Or have we been in here yet? No, we have not been in here yet. Portraits. Don't these come alive or something? All of them look alike. They seem to be portraits of the barrows. Well, that's weird. A sturdy wooden cabinet. It's empty. Again, unfortunate. Yeah, I'm sure there's... So oh! Hello! It's fucking Santa Claus. Let's get out of here. Let's take him to the kitchen. And serve him a slice of his own fried ass. Come on, Jennifer. There we go. Through the door. Kitchen. Go to the kitchen. I'm not going to hide in the box. That was a bad idea. Apparently, that was a bad idea. I mean, who knew, right? But yeah, apparently that was a bad idea. This is also a very bleak castle. You know, I didn't expect sunshine and roses, but it is a very bleak, miserable looking castle. There we go. Come to Papa. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bon appetit, bitch. Right, let's get out of it. We are kind of making him look a bit stupid, aren't we? Okay. So, let's go back to where we were. You can see um, the fact that we've been injured by the fact that our cursor is flashing orange. Oh, God. That's not the way we want to go, is it? That's the way we want to go. Uh, eventually, that will heal back up to white. Now, if we get injured again, uh, it will be red. And then, no matter what happens, if we get hurt, we die. The health system in this game is strange. Because you don't always take health damage. Uh, a lot of things are just straight up instant kill. Sturdy wooden cabinet. It's empty. All right. Let's have a look, see what's here. A pot, strangely, it isn't rusty. Is that really that strange? Portraits are in a row. They seem to be glaring at me. That's ominous. Hopefully Santa's going to stay back. Sofa is covered with dust. I wouldn't want to sit here. No. It'd be terrible if we got dusty, wouldn't it? What a big fireplace. Yeah, it'd be crazy if Santa came down there. Even worse if Scissorman came through there. Ooh. Yeah, one of my earliest mem Oh god. So many doors amongst doors amongst doors and doors and so many doors. Like I have seen people speedrun this game. And it just astounds me how they can remember like every single air Ooh, hello. Area. Oh, there's a book on the bed. Okay, what's the book? A large book. The cover is made of copper. Well, that's a thing, I guess. You now have the copper book. Excellent. We'll hold on to that. A file drawer. Hair is scattered about. I wonder whose hair. 
<laughs> Ooh. Yep. I forgot about you. Come on, Jennifer. Fight. Fight. Oh, hang on. There we go. Right, grab the thing. Grab the thing. Stab the thing with the thing. There we go. Ah! Yeah, that's pretty rough. Have we got our health back at least? Yellowed with age. Nothing inside. So there's definitely some weird funky voodoo going on in here. We've got portraits that, you know, float around. We've got haunted statues. And now we have the thing just, you know, chilling out in a drawer. That's fine. You know, everything's fine. <clears throat> I mean, I think Jennifer handled that pretty well, all things considered. So we've got another gate there. Oh! This just leads to the other side here. Okay. Right. That makes this significantly less complicated than Sterky. Let Ooh. Won't even budge. But will it budge? Uh, I guess. Nope. I guess we can't. Okay. Right, let's go back to the main room then. And try another path. We've got a lot of items here, but I don't think we've found anywhere to use anything. At least not yet. I know there's another key we can get. There's at least one more key we can get. But I can't remember exactly where it is. Let's try this way. There's this door here. Pretty sure. Looks like the door to the chapel. Won't even budge. Yeah. And we haven't been through there yet either. So let's have a little look in here. And see what we can find. Uh, oh yeah. I remember. Big hole. Big hole of nothingness. Okay. Well, I suppose we're kind of running out of options, really. Move your ass, girl. Actually... What's this way? A grating. Well, that's no good. Let me examine this picture. An oil painting. Yeah, same old thing. Alright. Well, let's go take our final door, I believe. We need to find some items. Ah. This looks a little bit more interesting now, doesn't it? This must be the master bedroom. The beds look luxurious. Well, I mean, sure. If you say so, Jennifer. Yeah. Lovely beds. Oh, hello. I don't mind the mousy. I'm sure, he's having fun, just chilling. An old yellowed newspaper. 1912. That's over 80 years ago. Is that the last time this place was inhabited? Maybe. Okay. I think that mouse ran in here. Ah, there's a small hole in the wall behind the table. Okay. Can we do anything? A key! There we go. You now have the library key. Excellent. Have we found a library? Uh, a, very, a closet. Very old coats are hung inside. Well, I don't think we fancy a wardrobe change right about now. Although we are in the right area, if we wish to do so. 
My hair is a mess. Yeah, I don't think that's really relevant, to be honest, Jennifer. I'm just saying. Unless you're still trying to woo Nolan. And to be honest, I don't think he cares what your hair looks like. So, we have a library key. Hmm. I'm pretty sure we picked up a library key. Bit weird. There's no way to open it. Okay. Does the library key not slot into our inventory for some reason? Am I missing something? A library key. Where, where did you put the library key? There's a mouse hole in the wall. Papers and old clothes are scattered about. Uh, yeah, that's cool. I guess... I guess she did pick up the library key, but for some reason it's not in our inventory? Question mark? Not really sure what that's about. Anyway, guys, I'm going to have to cut this one short here. Otherwise, we're not going to have enough time to do enough videos for the whole week. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.